Today is Thursday, April 3rd, 2020, and this is the beginning of the beehive. It was delivered today, actually the rest of it. I had two of the boxes that I painted, and you'll notice the handiwork on the sides to let the bees know that this is their home and it helps them to identify with their hive. So the bees were supposed to be delivered tomorrow, Saturday, but that has been pushed off till Tuesday now, in which case then I will be starting the official beehive video. But at the moment, I'm gonna show you the construction of the beehive. So if you'll hang on for a second, let me pause this and show you. Hold on. Okay, the inside of the beehive has these frames, which I will show you. Let me remove this layer. It has the frames, and this is a 10 frame box. These are plastic and they're coated with wax, beeswax, to help the bees get started with making honeycomb, etc. So when she delivers the bees on Tuesday now, she will bring the frames that fit in the center here. She'll bring five frames and they will have some already started honeycombs on them and the bees, etc., as well as the queen, which she will put them inside to get them started. So on top of this goes the top box, which for right now is the box that the feeder goes in. And this is the feeder. And what this is, is it will have a one-to-one -one sugar syrup solution poured into here. And on the underside, you can see this hole, and they will be able to get up into the screen area to get to the sugar water in order to get the sugar and start making honeycomb, etc. It's a nutritional thing because in the early spring, like right now, there isn't enough pollen and nectar for them to get to feed themselves, feed the queen, have the queen lay eggs, etc. So this will be done until probably May, in which case then they'll take we'll take this off, and then I'm not sure if the top box will come off or not. But for right now, this is how it's constructed. Then there is this top board that goes over top and this all this does is keep the bees from coming up and making honeycomb on the underside of the roof as so if they do that or they make a substance called propolis it's like super glue and that's what they use to seal things if they are allowed to do that you play heck trying to get the uh the hive apart. So this is what the beehive will look like for the moment. And we put the brick on top to keep it weighted down so the wind doesn't blow it off and hopefully no critters will come along. As you can see, I'll paint it the other side. We thought we were going to be facing it in the other direction, that direction, but this is okay. This will work too. So anyway, this is the beginning of the beehive at Waverly Farms. And on Tuesday, hopefully, I will have a full video of her bringing the bees with the queen and the, the frames. And beekeeping will begin. Okay, stay tuned. Make sure you hit subscribe. And the little bell at the bottom of this video and you'll get notifications every time I post another video. Alright, see you on Tuesday.